Kia ora guys, and welcome back to the channel. Now I think it's pretty fair to say that I've got a little bit of a, a mild obsession with buying old cameras and trying old cameras. I, 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 really, I really don't know what it's all about. Uh, I'm, just, I'm just enjoying it. I enjoy the whole process from looking at local auction sites, trying to get a few bargains on there, going down the local thrift shops, op shops, and uh, seeing what I can come up with. And I'm just trying to get a, you know, trying to work out how the things work and, you know, how to get a result out of them. Anyway, so I've, I'm really enjoying it, like I say. One of the cameras that I'm extra, extra obsessed with at the moment, it's a Ferrania Falco 2 6x9 folding camera. And oh, there's not too much information on the web about this camera. What bits I've managed to find suggest that optically, it's not the greatest camera in history. So the Italian manufacturers decided to go for what they know best, which is style and fashion. And being post-war Italy, they kind of pushed, pushed the look of this camera. And it's honestly, it's just beautiful. I love it to bits. It has unfortunately got a little bit of a light leak in the bellows somewhere. So I, so I really need to get that sorted out. This video here, the stills from this video here are the second shoot with the camera. The first shoot with the camera was a few weeks ago. That was okay, encouraging. The second shoot, this shoot, I've only just got the images back. So I, it was a color film, Kodak Ektar 100. Didn't have a Scooby up until an hour ago, what the photographs were like. In the meantime, I shot a third roll of film, a roll of Ilford FP4 Plus. Developed that last night at home. And, and man, I'm, I'm well pleased. And that video will be up later this week, I presume, if I crack on. Very, very impressed with those photographs. Anyway, today, the photo, this is confusing, man. The photographs from this video for today came back today. So I've just, I'm gonna put up the unedited versions, the actual files as, as they came back, and then I'm gonna put up the photographs after I've edited them, and uh, just just see, yeah, honestly, apart from the light flare, light leak, I'm, oh, my, I'm absolutely buzzing. Mistake I made with the second shoot, which I did on the first shoot as well, you cock the shutter, you fire the shutter. I've had my thumb at the side of the shutter. When I fire the shutter, it just, it, it doesn't. So initially when I loaded this film into the camera, the Ektar 100, I kind of wound on, wound on, wound on, and wound straight, wound straight past frame number one. So that's one frame down, dickhead. Second frame, the second shot I went to take, same thing, I held, the sh held, the, held my thumb on the shutter, Fired away, and unfortunately, so that one's a burner. Out of eight frames on this roll of film, I've just killed two, which leaves me six frames. Six frames, I was extra careful with them, handheld everything. From memory, the settings were something along the lines of F11, 125th of a second, something like that. It's not important. The important thing is the photographs, I like them. I really do like them. All power to the Ferrania Falco 2. 6x9 folder from 1948. <laughs> I absolutely love it. I love it so much so that I'm actually searching and bidding on another couple of uh, folding cameras. Um, both of them, fingers crossed, I'll get both of them and then I can play even more. On the right up, both of them have got better optics. So uh, saying that, I can't really see too much wrong with the optics on this little Ferrania. Anyway, guys, enough of me waffling on. Enjoy the video, enjoy the photographs, and uh, until next time, catch you later.